Alright guys, Killer Action 14, 16, 18 here again. Um, just gonna do a more in-depth review of my Castle 38 3S Lipo Max um, brushless motor from Castle. Um, 100,000 RPM, <clears throat> 3S Lipo Max, 3800 KV. It's their model 1410 Y, 1Y. Um, you got the nice snake logo there. And these super super duper long cords that it comes with. You can see the extra cord length you have there. Nice green can, 540 size can with fin ridges on it. Um, four pole motor, it says four more torque. Um, compared to a two pole motor, um, I would definitely say that this does have more torque torque just because four or two more magnet poles in your standard two pole which makes it go around and you can see it's it's quite hard to turn the rotor to see the way that is so you can get this for the SCT combo on Amazon for a hundred bucks this and this I have soldered on here um, EC5 connectors so and this is the uh, ESC that it comes with like I said uh, it has here's your standard connector um, orange red and brown and then it comes with another red and black connector for your fan and then here's your switch um, overall from having this ESC um, I would I would probably give it uh I don't know. Um I guess we'll start with the I'm not gonna rate it, I was going to, but I guess you really can't with an ESC. Um I've had this for about six months now and just uh you can see my unboxing of this specifically and other Castle Creation products. Uh, it's my second combo I've ever purchased for a hundred bucks because it's just such a good deal. Um I would probably start with the cons. Con number one is the fact that this switch, when it gets dirt in it, you gotta like take it apart and there's this metal thing in there and you gotta take it apart, clean it out. I had to call Castle because the CSE actually stopped working and uh, for that to stop working, I tried everything to get this thing to power back on. Man, I did everything in my willpower except to not buy any new ASC, so I ended up thinking to myself, man, I'm not going to be able to drive a car because this ESC just broke on me, so I went ahead and bought that Hobby Wing SC10 for 45 bucks on Value Hobby. You can see a review on that, and it's in my LCG Slash, but yeah. So I ended up fixing this, called Castle, and they helped me out. Great customer service. Um, but there was, uh, I don't know, actually, I would give probably the customer service a, uh, a thumbs up and a thumbs down. I called the first time about this, and a dude said that I was that the discharge rating I was using for my LiPo batteries is too low. Then I called again thinking, like, that doesn't sound right. I've been using these batteries forever. The Turnigy 20 to 40C discharge or 20 to 30C, I forget what it is. But, I mean, come on, I've been using those forever. And so I call up one guy that I am really close to, um, and he knows a lot about Castle Creation products, and he says, that doesn't sound right. I'm using the same thing for mine, and I've had my ESC for over a year now. So I call, tell the guy, and he's like, Another guy answers the phone and tells me it's just a switch and I can cut it off and solder the two together or just fix it. And so he told me the way to fix it. So that's that. Um, I think these are, I don't know what size millimeter connectors these are, but they're just a standard for Castle, I guess. You can just plug those in. Um, it's got the nice logo on the side. I ended up ripping it off and I was taking this apart to fix the fan. You got to take the fan off and clean it out all the dust and dirt, but yeah. Uh, you can see plenty of running videos of this on 2S, 3S. Um, 3S obviously is the max. I'm not going to go to 4S um, unless I want more motor heat. But that's that. Um, if you have any questions or concerns about this video, please let me know. If you, you can go ahead and comment below if you have any interest in any of these and you thought this video was helpful. Please subscribe.